Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. If almost everybody died in Mass Effect 2. All right, we have our hardened, old, grizzled shepherd renegade here with those piercing red eyes. And in this episode, we are going to look at what if Tally died in Mass Effect 2. So we're here to meet with the Quarians. Commander Shepard, a pleasure to see you again, though I wish it were under better circumstances. I had hoped for your support in the fight against the Reapers. What's going on? Seventeen days ago, with precision strikes on four Geth systems, the Quarians initiated the war to retake our homeworld which was a clear violation of our agreement with the Council to avoid provoking the Geth. A treaty violation is nothing compared to recovering our homeworld and advanced AI technology. Good, it's about time. I'm glad to hear that you're finally reclaiming your homeworld. Actually, our timing may have been premature. We'd driven the Geth back to the home system when this signal began broadcasting to all Geth ships. The Reapers. Under Reaper control, the Geth are significantly more effective. Our fleet is pinned in the home system. If we're going to win, we are... Win? You insisted on involving the civilian ships, Admiral Geralt. We need to retreat or we'll lose the light ships. Where's the signal coming from? Here. A Geth dreadnought. It can outgun anything we've got and it's heavily defended. The Normandy stealth drive can get us in undetected. I could board. Then disable the Reaper command signal. Yes. Cutting off the signal should throw the Geth into complete disarray. And then you counterattack. And when the Geth are weakened, you strike hard. It's a hell of a risk, Commander. But if you can pull it off... Just be ready, Admiral. I'll accompany you. You'll need my expertise in hacking Geth systems. Admirals, I'll ready a team to hit that dreadnought. Thank you, Commander. Wow. So, as you can see, there's no dramatic entrance of a new... What do they call it? Admiral? Admiral Voss Normandy does not make a dramatic entrance. And we now have Admiral, whatever her name is, Zen, accompanying, accompanying us to disable the Dreadnought. All right, well, since we're here, let's go ahead because we can answer another question. What if Legion died in Mass Effect 2? Let's go. All right, let's see. Do we... Yeah, let's take Edie. No, wait. Last time I did that, she was having trouble. But that wasn't on the Dreadnought, was it? I think that was on Rannoch. Alright. I want Edie and James. Liara can stay. All right, and we're going with the in-class heavy armor. And I think we're going to try a different gun. Yes, here, the Revenant. Okay, so James, let's give him something new. How about a Matok? Alright, 
still has his piranha. Did we um, upgrade any other shotguns? Huh, how about the Crusader? And Edie is fine with these mods here. Alright, still haven't leveled up anybody here, but Edie. Let's go ahead. Hmm. Give her burning damage. Alright, that's it. Let's go. We're approaching the Corian home system. ETA to Rannoch, five minutes. What have you got from the comm buoys? Pretty much a big old shitstorm, Commander. I have detected several hundred unique ship signatures engaged in active combat. Yeah, like I said. Take us in, Joker. Stealth drive engaged. Only way they'll detect us is if you all start singing the Russian national anthem. I should get used to this by now. I've done this numerous times at this point. No wonder the Quarians were having trouble. That ship is enormous. It is 30% larger than an Alliance Dreadnought. I don't think I can do it that way. I think it's up here and down. Yeah, but folks, I think this is going to be my final playthrough of Mass Effect. It has been fun. I've gotten my money's worth. You know, I've gotten to see all the different dialogue options. Any problems so far, Commander? Well, the lack of gravity is a little disorienting. You'll have artificial gravity once you're aboard the Dreadnought. Until then, I'll make do with mag boots. Hey, take your time, Commander. We're fine until they... Get to hear additional dialogue from Claudia Black as Admiral Zinn. Looks like the rest of the team isn't using the docking tube. So I'm guessing you'd rather not solo the Dreadnought. Not if I can help it. Ask Admiral Zen to get schematics for the Dreadnought. If you can point me at another docking tube, I'll override the controls and let the boarding party on. I've got gravity again. Excellent. Now to find another tube. Uh, there's a hull breach not too far from your position. 
The nearest undamaged docking tube is on the other side. I think I found that hull breach you mentioned. Courtesy of Admiral Gerald's assault plan. Six destroyed frigates later, we successfully made a tiny hole. I wouldn't call it tiny. Hmm. Not the way you'd have done it? His strategy worked while my technology advances drove the Geth back. It was certainly preferable to Ran's bloodless caution or Chorus's Geth sympathies. But when the Reapers took control, we lost our advantage. We could lose the entire fleet. Not if I have anything to say about it. Okay, can I put on my cryo ammo? Thank you. Uh oh. I found another airlock. I think we're good to go. Excellent. If you could override the controls, we'll join you in a moment. Thank you, Shepard. I will try to find a more convenient docking point next time. Next time? There's a way forward through here. I can stay while you secure the area ahead. Oh, and tell me what you think of my new prototype. Excellent. We're clear to proceed. We will pick up the arc pistol. It is. And we leveled up. Transmits an energy pulse that disrupts Geth programming and shields. That is much like using polonium tipped rounds against organics, which is illegal. So where are we headed? A central operations center. Once you secure it, I'll join you to disable the Reaper command signal. Where's the closest one? Past the defense network and through a sensor cluster. Oh, so she's gonna hang back. Interesting. The dreadnoughts using ultraviolet frequencies instead of the standard infrared. Expensive. Bet it gives them an edge in close combat, though. No wonder the Quarians are getting whipped. All right, we got our sniper rifle scope. get them all that was pretty quick more get forces incoming One thing about this Revenant, it's not, it has a lot of recoil. Alright, there we go. Even with adrenaline rush, it's kind of hard to keep it on target. 
What? Ah. Oh, those trip mines. is amazingly complex. It is unsurprising that the Quarians have been unable to disrupt it. All right, we have an Archon Visor. Shepard to Zen. I think we're coming up on the operation center. Understood. I'll be there momentarily. Good. Let's cut the Reaper signal and turn the tables on these bastards. The cloaked guest will be approaching. Try hiding now, asshole. Forces. That's it. I recommend we examine the affected console. Oh, no, another one of those mines. I didn't even notice it. Wow, this revenant is making short work of these things. Okay, SMG scope. Seems I missed the excitement. The Gath tried to disable the console. Can you take a look? Where They've is locked she? us out. Ah, there she we is. can't shut the signal down from here in the operation center. Where can we shut it down? Yes, the drive floor. That's where the Reaper signal is being generated. So if we get there, we shut it down? Yes, but the Geth have sealed the emergency bulkheads. We're blocked. We have to find a path to the drive floor that the Geth can't lock off. Ideally, a path that runs the length of the ship. What about the main battery? It runs right by the drive core. It's possible, yes. But? Yes, but the Geth have sealed the emergency bulkheads. We're blocked unless we open these doors. High-level processes are locked. We need something basic. A ship-wide emergency, like a fire. What about the heat diffusion system? Possible. Triggering a thermal warning would open every maintenance tube in this sector for venting. Would that override the lockdown? It would indeed. I'm rigging the main console. Incidentally, I'm picking up hostile Geth on the other side of the door. Watch it! Coming in from the ceiling! Be alert for more cloaked Geth. They brought friends! Looks like you could use a hand. to tell me twice. Where's Admiral Zen? She just disappeared? Wait, wasn't there something I'm over here I'm supposed to see? Look at how much data the Dreadnought Central Processor is handling. Their threaded processing is remarkably effective. I would not be able to handle that much data alone. 
What, you? Edie, don't let me be disappointed. Hey, Fubar, Commander. The lines are all wrong. Nothing's in the right spot. Intriguing. I found the geometric shapes intuitive and comfortable. I assumed you all felt the same. I can detect the faint presence of Geth intelligences. Those not loaded into mobile platforms serve in the ship itself. Shouldn't be too much farther to the main battery. Progress, Commander. We're getting there. Everything okay on your end? Quite. The Geth sent reinforcements to the bridge, but they were quite amenable to one of my hacking routines. Hmm. They're doing a lovely dance right now in a moment. They're going to serve refreshments. Hmm. We'll keep you posted on our progress. Shepard out. Admiral Zen's attitude towards synthetic life forms is a concern. Noted. Okay, some credits. Commander, a planetary defense cannon has taken down Admiral Chorus's ship. Survivors? Unknown. Oh, and I have Admiral Ron trying to establish a secure link. Put her through. Shepard, this is Ron. The heavy fleet is collapsing. I don't know how much longer we can hold out. We'll have the Reaper signal deactivated shortly, Admiral. And here it goes, my least favorite mission. Or my least favorite part of a mission. Dag on pulse cannon. All right, come on. Watch the shock waves. That's a big gun. You ain't kidding. We will be safe if we remain in cover. I guess we need to move. We need to shut it down. Look for a maintenance lock to shut down this section. Um, come on now. We're Locate the activation console right here. Did that work? No. What was this then if that didn't shut it down? up here.
I mean, weren't we just over here? Look out! Alright, where is the ladder that takes me up there? Or the stairs? I think we have to go further down. people this way. Anything hidden over here in the corner? No. All right, here's the question about Legion. Who is this? Is that Legion? Shepard Commander. It Top is. Bus. I remember you. You were on board the Derelict Reaper where I found the IFF. Yes. I gave your body to Cerberus. Oh. We are a reconstruction of that now defunct intelligence. 
We were originally created to investigate the activities of the old machines. Old machines? You mean the Reapers? Yes. When those you call Reapers took control of the Geth, we were imprisoned here. Okay, so I've not done a playthrough where we actually gave Legion to Cerberus. Interesting. Sure you were. The Geth were reprogrammed by the Reapers. I doubt you're an exception. Shepard Commander, wait. We can assist you. The old machines are using us to broadcast their signal to all Geth units simultaneously. And that makes me less likely to shoot you... how? We will help liberate the Geth from their control. Destroy us, and they will remain the slaves of your enemies. Freeing us will end the signal. You may then destroy us if you deem it necessary. Fine. We'll get you out. Weapons ready. If this thing so much as twitches. Wait. You cannot simply remove the restraints. We are secured via hardware blocks nearby that shackle our operating protocols. I am familiar with the concept. The AI shackle Cerberus used to keep you under control. Yes. Used by organics, it is understandable. Forget to install this in a formerly independent unit is... unnecessary. The hardware blocks are on the far side of the room. Far side of the room, you said? Yes. Deactivation should be simple. The Geth protected them against viral attack, not physical removal. How'd the Reapers get control of the Geth? They did not. The Creators attacked. The Geth wished to live. The old machines extended an offer. So they chose slavery over destruction? Yes. Mm. We'll have you out of there soon. <clears throat> Got it. Zen, the signal's about to go offline. Tell the fleet to be ready. I have them patched in, Commander. This is Admiral Hangel. We're in your debt. Hardware blocks offline. We are free. Zenta Shepard, something I should know, Commander. As a gesture of cooperation, we have disabled the Dreadnought's Drive Core. All weapons and barriers are offline. Alert! Get reinforcements incoming! Shot on that prime. Where is it? What are you doing? Ron, check your screens. The dreadnought is helpless. No barrier. And the main gun is offline. We can remove their flagship if we strike now. Damn it! We have made you a counter-attack, not a blind charge. 
tally, not tally. There we go. the turret. Alright, we got another prime. ED overload. James, frag grenade. to our first death here.
They fired on the Dreadnought while you were on board? I can't help them win this war if they're gonna go off half-cocked like this. I know. Admiral Garrel's been causing trouble along the Turian border for years. But I can understand their desperation. We only lost Earth a few weeks back. We haven't lost Earth yet. We need help, Shepard. We need a fleet. And the Corians have the biggest one out there. I'll get it, Admiral. Your unilateral strike endangered us all. I should charge you with treason. I was within my authority as Admiral of the Heavy Fleet. And what of Shepard and Admiral Zen? They escaped unharmed. Shepard, the mission parameters changed. Your military, you understand that. Hmm, you're out of control. I understand that you ignored the plan and charged in without thinking. The Dreadnought was a... <clears throat> Admiral, you jeopardized your mission and your people. Get the hell off my ship. Shepard, I understand you're angry. If I didn't need your fleet... Han only respect brute force. You must understand. The Geth inflicted heavy casualties before you disabled the Reaper signal. You said they have a planetary defense cannon? Had. Admiral Corus sacrificed his own ship to destroy it. He crash-landed on the home world. The Normandy can assist with rescue efforts. Thank you, Commander. I think the worst is over. The Geth no longer possess the programming upgrades they had while enslaved by the Reapers. Shepard Commander, we are prepared to offer assistance. What the hell is this? <laughs> wait, wait. Everybody calm down. It's a hologram reconstruction of some kind. Oh, a hologram. It says it's on our Interesting. Side. It wants to fight the Reapers. This is a fascinating prototype. With some study, I may be able to use it to find a weakness in the Geth consensus. Later. Let's hold off for now. I don't want to jeopardize this thing's useful intel. Understood, Commander. So, you say you can help? Yes. What can you tell us about the Geth? How will they react without Reaper guidance? This is a false assumption. You have cut off long-range control, but the old machines placed a base on Rannoch for short-range direction. The Geth still have Reaper upgrades. Correct. They are currently disorganized, but once the short-range signal is in place, they will recover. Kila. I need to warn the fleet. Zen, coordinate with Garrow. Move! We need to take out the Reaper base. Where's it located? Unknown. Find it. Understood. We do know the location of a server from which Geth fighter squadrons are controlled. The squadrons are targeting creator life ships. Disabling them will limit casualties. We offer assistance. Thanks. All right, let's. Edie, can you clean this up? Turn that off. Ron, the Kinesh is getting swarmed by Geth fighters. Damn it. Interceptors, divert to the Kinesh. Thank you, Commander. If you hadn't enhanced that signal, we'd have lost the ship. Oh, that's the least I could do. Let's see our... Yeah, our effective military strength is, is already uh, up there to where it needs to be. He's done a good job despite being a renegade. All right, well, that's going to conclude What If, Tally, and Legion. Legion sort of, I guess, died in Mass Effect 2. He was actually given over to Cerberus, and we get a hologram in his place. And Tally, we get Admiral Zen. All right, I'm not sure which What If we're doing next. But we are almost at the end. I think there are just two more. I'm kind of curious. What if... I don't know. The Quarians and the um, Geth... Can come to some sort of agreement on Rannoch without Tally? 
I don't know if that's even possible. And then the other, uh, should be the last one, I believe, would be, um, Miranda. I could be wrong, but we'll see. We've got possibly two more, um, episodes. Maybe a little more. We'll see. All right, until next time, this is Hill, and I'm out.